Hello. Hello. Hi, this is Nathan calling you from your TV services. How are you doing today? I'm okay. How are you? I'm fine, sir. Thank you for asking. Sir, actually the reason to give you a call is that we need to update, we need to modify your TV boxes, your receiver boxes. They are outdated. So by any chance, are you watching your TV right now? Yes! Uh, so sir, grab your TV remote control in your hand so I will start the update. Oh, well, I was watching Indian Peasant Sex on the Playboy channel, so I actually had something else in my hand, but let me reach over for the uh, remote control here. Okay, I have the remote control in my hand. Uh, what do you want me to do with it? Uh, sir, uh, can you see the company name, company logo at the bottom side of your remote control? It has a name. Can you see that? Oh, well, this is the name that I see. Hello. I'm here. Hi, good morning. This is Sarah. How's your day going so far? My day is a bottomless pit of agony and despair. I am sorry to hear that. I am just calling to let you know that the government is giving you subsidy to help you pay your bills without any cost to you. So do you currently have any government or state provided health insurance? No, I have nothing. And I could definitely use getting my hands on some subsidies. Okay, well, we work with leading 27 insurance companies under the Affordable Care Act and they all have different eligibility criteria and different benefits. I strongly recommend you must check your eligibility with us again. Can you tell me if you have any Medicaid or Medicare? I don't have Medicare and I don't have Medicaid. Okay, that's perfect. You seem eligible for this subsidy so far. Just one last thing, are you under the age of 65? Yes! Well, perfect. You are eligible for this subsidy. We have a benefit specialist on the line who will find you the best benefits available in your area free of cost. I'm transferring your call now. Please bear with the music for just a moment. I definitely look forward to speaking with this specimen about getting those subsidies. Hi. Good afternoon. My name is Mark. How are you doing today? I'm okay. How are you? I'm doing great. Thank you so much for asking. God bless you. All this call is about we are providing you exclusive or benefit designed for people under 65. I do believe that if you don't have Medicare, Medicaid, VA, TRICARE, or any other entire coverage, right? I don't have Medicare. I don't have Medicaid. And even though I was once in the military, I don't have WEA or TRICARE. What happened is I was stationed as a guard at the U.S. Embassy in Islamabad in May 2011. And I got a call from my aunt in America saying a call center worker in Rawal Pindi. Hello? Hello? How can I abuse you? Hello? 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 Hi, this is Ada. And I'm calling because I see here you didn't receive the subsidy to affordable care act. Do you have a marketplace insurance? No! No one gives old man Robert Grinnell anything. Hello? 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 How can I abuse you? Yes, sir. How was your day going so far? 
It's okay. How is yours? Well, thank you so much for asking. I'm just having a bad day so far, so good. And uh, the reason we give you this short call is just to make you qualify for your benefits. That will help you to pay your health care bill. So I just want to make sure that you are not missing any new benefits right now. How young you are? I'm 51. You are 51 years young. Okay. So at the age of 51, I believe you don't have any kind of uh, Medicare, Medicaid, or any employer coverage. Is that correct? I have no Medicare. I have no Medicaid. I have no employer coverage. No one gives old man Robert okay. Grinnell anything. Okay, that's perfect, sir. So, as the North State is providing these benefits and subsidies, these are only for those people who don't have any kind of a Medicare, or Medicaid, or an employee coverage. So, go ahead with your zip code. My zipper code is 48126. 48126, I got you, sir. And just one last thing from my side, you're making less than $40,000 in a year, is that correct? Yes, you don't make as much money as okay. you would think being a chef at a crystal meth lab. Oh, all right, sir, I got it. Well, that's great. Well, that's all the information to make uh, to verify you for these uh, government subsidies and additional benefits. You don't have Oh, you know, oh, these benefits so will help you to pay your health your bills, like for your, you can qualify for some additional benefits as well, like for your groceries, utility, your travel expenses, and all of those benefits. So these are totally free of cost for those people who are younger than 65 and who are making low income. Actually, it's not for everyone. So try all that information. You are a perfect candidate to get these benefits. Now, uh, without wasting your time, if I go ahead and show you something that really makes sense to you and help you, would you think about it? Yes, I really want to get my hands on those subsidies. Okay, so that's perfect, sir. So, sir, I... Okay, uh, so when, uh, who do I have players speaking with? Robert Grinnell! Robert Grinnell, sir, I got you. Can you uh, talk a, a little bit slower, sir? Well, I've been talking like this ever since a rival drug dealer shot me in the head with an AK-47. But luckily, the bullet is only lodged oh in a part God. of the brain that controls the volume of my voice. And ever since then, neighborhood okay. children have been mocking me. When I sit down for a period of time, they'll put a refrigerator magnet on the back of my head where there's a metal plate, and I'll walk around all day with the refrigerator magnet on my head, and I won't even know it. Okay. All right, so well, God bless you with more help. So seems like uh, you're uh, on a disability right now, like for your hearing. Well, no, I'm not on uh, disability. No one gives me anything. I just have to cope right. with my uh, high tone of voice and kids putting uh, refrigerator magnets on the uh, plate on my head. And uh, at least now I have a refrigerator that's covered with, uh, uh, with these uh, refrigerator magnets. Thanks to those kids putting those uh, magnets on my head. All right, I got you. So that's not a problem. We can, we can obviously help you with that. So without wasting your time, uh, let me just grab my uh, licensed person from your local area according to your zip code, and he's going to let you know what kind of additional benefits and subsidies you're entitled to get at $0 cost to you, okay? Okay. Am I speaking with a senior suppository or a licensed anus? Uh, you're, you, uh, you'll be going to uh, talk to my licensed Agent, sir. Okay, I look forward to speaking not, with right, your licensed uh, anus. Oh, uh, it depends on, uh, you know, uh, we have, uh, however, we have two thousand plus agents across this country. So I can your zip code uh, into your uh, local area. Uh, we have almost uh, hand, uh, 120 or 30 something agents like that. So I'm not sure uh, what his name. So give me a moment, let me just connect you with him, and he's going to let you know all the details about the subsidies in which you are entitled to get, okay? Okay. 
I read that bridge also. I will send you a call with my licensed person. Once you get connected, simply let them know that you're here for a subsidy, a zero dollar subsidy plan, okay? Okay. I look forward to speaking right. with whatever anus you send me. Agent, sir. Okay. All right, so give me a moment. Uh, I look at your call with my license agent. Even if your number is on any federal or state, do not call this. Will that be okay to you? Yes. All right, so stay with me. I'll appreciate your time. Good morning. My name is Adam Brown. How are you doing today? Doing good? I'm okay. How are you? I'm good. Thank you so much for asking, sir. The reason we give you a call is to provide you free health insurance to ET Affordable Care Act. By any chance, do you got any active health insurance through your work, marketplace, Medicare, Medicaid, VA, TRICARE coverage or not yet? I don't have Medicare. I don't have Medicaid. I don't have marketplace. I don't have employer coverage. And even though I was once in the military, I don't have VA or TRICARE. What happened is I was stationed at the U.S. Embassy in Islamabad as a guard in May 2011. And I got a call from my aunt in America saying a call center worker in Rawell Pindi stole her life savings. So I became a little bit angry and I went AWOL and I liberated the limousine of the U.S. Ambassador to Pakistan. And then I drove 50 minutes to Rawell Pindi and I entered the call center and I found the call center worker, and I took him hostage, and I pistol whipped him. Hello? Hello? Please like and subscribe. Thank you.